Hey guys, what's up? All right, all right, all right. Welcome back to my channel. Hey, today I uh, I have something important to talk about um, for engine management. Um, and I had been contacted by a person who is an engineer, and uh, he was looking in. He actually has a looks like a working prototype, and uh, so let's get to it. So I was contacted. Um, this, this guy, he's um, I don't know, he's an engineering student or something like that. But his uh, the photos he sent me were really, really awesome. Um, he has created a engine management system for the uh, the Toyin L200, I think the L100, and he's working on one for the uh, for the L400, and um, so. Now it's going to have, um, he had an example of the L200, it's going to have fuel injection, it's going to have um, on board uh, glow igniters, and he's talking even a check engine light uh, for the thing so it can determine, you know, what's going wrong. So that would be a huge plus in, in this, this is probably a first in this market. But the reason I'm doing that is because I want everybody to blow this video up as huge as possible because um, everybody who has one of these, we're still dealing with the dinosaur technology. Um, now, the guy who's making this stuff, he wants to see what the reaction is to us hobbyists, okay? That's the reason why I want this to go huge um, because he has... You know he, he spent a lot of time on this and um, he is also looking into the uh, the crank dilemma for the L 400s um, it's nice to get like an engineer involved in something like this um, I, I believe he's more of an electrical engineer but you know engineers are um, you know they, they 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 know a lot and they they've been taught a lot so they're, they're uh, they can do about anything they want you know what I mean so so like I said put your comments down there because what I'm gonna do is pass this video on to him and um, have you know he have everybody he wants to read what everybody says you know so but like I say the the L200 unit that he had was pretty crazy it had like small little coil like a igniter packs on it um, and it was a nice neat little pigtail now he had mentioned that if if this goes big enough he'd like to send me one to try out on one of my l200s or whatever engine he wants to develop it for and i told him i'd be very interested in doing that to see how well it works you know um so you know just a short video but like i said before you know uh it it's a first it's a first i'll put it that way because um he has like they say um he's got one in the in the mix there so i'd like to see this thing come to life to be honest with you so like i say like share subscribe if you want um make sure you comment down below so he can read the comments um because he wants to know if it's worth putting it into production i think it is for the simple fact of you know there's a lot of these engines out there um, the L200s have a uh, like a carburetor problem you know what I mean but they're a good engine um, if you could fill inject that that'd be great if you could fill inject this you know or even this it would be uh, so simple because it's a plug-and-play you just start it and go so you know that could be one of the reasons why the cranks are breaking in this because maybe one cylinder is getting flooded out and locking it up hydro locking it and breaking it who knows you know, if you fill inject it, now you've got a consistent, in each cylinder, um, amount of fuel going in there. And, uh, and you'll have a proper ignition to your glow plug with his system. So, all right, let, anyway, that's a quick video for today. But like I say, you know, throw the comments out there and pass this video on. Because I would really like to see that come to life. And if he gives me one, I definitely will put something on here. And, uh 
because this is going to benefit everybody. So, all right, guys, you guys take it easy and stay cool, man. I'll catch you later. Adios.